I won't do so much as retire as probably change what I do. Right. I'll probably move more into things like, uh, you know, books and so forth, the yeah. arts and all. Mm. Sort of touch of the Michael Portillo. <laughs> but the, I'll still probably keep more involved in politics yeah, yeah. Than, than he's done. Sure. Um, and I think that's partly because you get to the point where, you know, having to run across the road all the time to catch a division gets to be a little hard going. Mm. Uh, but I don't think I want to retire in the sense of, you know, going and sitting on a deck chair. I think I'd be bored stiff within a day. I think you would as well. I think <laughs> you have to keep you have to keep going. And don't we're all you? getting older, you see. So oh, the great yes. thing is keep going longer. I think so. You know, eventually we all die, but you, if you don't keep going longer, your life stops long before it needs to. Mm. And I think as long as my mind's all well, obviously some of my opponents would think my mind's bonkers <laughs> anyway. But <laughs> if if you take the view that being reasonable yeah. is what you need to be, mm. able to remember, able to. Uh, answer questions and so on. I don't see any reason why you should pull out. No, absolutely not. And, and and it's women like yourself that encourage other women to come into politics and that's what we want to do. We do. And we that's one of the real do. problems. That mm. What I said earlier, that sure. so many women think they're not up to it. And they are. I mean, women are wonderful. And uh, they, they have a very much more, often much more sensible, down-to-earth attitude. Mm -hmm. I and mean, it's your Scots. And what's quite striking, of course, is that it's you all know very well. Um, a very much larger proportion of women voted to keep in the... To keep in the UK union than men um, and that's what you'd expect because women are more realistic they're more recognized things the way they are men dream and then stumble over the dream sometimes straight into the mud but that, that's a very sharp distinction and you mm. see it all the time but you still see what we're up against I mean look at the way in fact that now that uh, Hillary uh, Clinton who I know quite well is mm. running in the United States the big issue becomes not what she stands for, what her policies are, but whether a woman can become president. So that the gender trumps hmm. all the policies and ideas and thinking that you have. And that's still true in the United States, more than here, I think, now.